Hello, I'm going to show you how to make lighting. Very, very easy. Should take less than five minutes. Okay, this, our finished result should look a little something like this. So now I'm just going to delete this and we'll get into the video. So first we insert a part. I'm just going to move this part a tad bit higher so it's easier for me to see the lightning. Then we add two attachments. I'm just going to add one attachment, then duplicate it. Control D to duplicate. I'm going to rename one of the attachments to something random like the letter R. Add a beam. Just going to, I might be a tad bit laggy. It has nothing to do with the, like actual Roblox Studio. It's just my recording, but that's okay. Okay, so now we're going to make attachment zero, R, and attachment one, this attachment. So I'm going to move the attachment forward. So that's going to be the end of the lightning, and that's going to be where the lightning starts. As you can see, it's just a beam, so I'm going to get my texture, link in the description. Now I'm going to copy it in here where it says texture, but it's really, really tiny. We can barely see it, so I'm going to increase its size to something like 12, definitely a random number. Segments to 4, so it's small lightning-y. Now I'm going to make it just a tad bit longer by setting texture length to 0.5. See, now it's long, but it's not that bright, so time to make it bright. So first I'm going to set transparency to zero, light influence to zero, light emission to one to add that brightness, and since light influence is zero, it can change the brightness to 100. Yes, this, look, this is looking good. Now we're just going to duplicate this. Duplicate the light in where you want. Well, after, remember to duplicate it with the beam. If not, it wouldn't look at all. <laughs> it wouldn't work. Okay, so when you're done this, you should get something that looks a little like this. But you're asking me, Phoenix, where's the lightning? I came here for lightning, not beams. This looked cool on your own. But what we could do now is rotate the... Okay, good. Rotate these to get our lightning effect we've all been waiting for. Depending on how we rotate it, that's how the lightning will look. So it looks like this now. If I wrote like this, it will look different. And like this, it will look completely different. Okay, now just rotate it till you like it. For this video, I'm just going to rotate it randomly. When you're done, you should get a little something like this. But you can see the lightning's just shooting off at random times. If that's not what you want, then just Ctrl C this to copy, then paste it again. And now they'll shoot at the same time. I hope this helped you. If you enjoyed, leave a like. I'm going to be posting more videos like this. So if this is something you like, stick around. I'll see you in the next video.